Hey, what's up everybody? There are thousands of things said about women related to their behavior, skills, intelligence, etc. Logically speaking, there are a number of poets and lyricists who always write that men do not know about women and women are good at keeping secrets for themselves. Yeah, might be true. May God help us with all this technology to understand them in the future at least. But scientifically speaking, anybody can keep secrets. There is no gender in this topic. I hope if you think broadly, definitely you will agree with me or better to say, you will agree with science. It seems like we know almost everything about women, how many words they utter a day, why they recognize so many shades of colors and how much lipstick they ingest in a lifetime, etc. However, scientists decided to dig a little deeper and found out many more interesting and unusual things about the nature of women. I would say for sure, you will be definitely surprised to know these seven facts, seven modern scientific research about women, some of which are very controversial. These facts are absolutely taken for average. Let us jump into the video and see them one by one. Welcome back everybody. If anybody is new here has not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button to support our channel. Let's see the facts. Fact number one. Women are good at remembering what should be done, not what has been done. This can be my personal experience too. Every woman is familiar with the situation of a man forgetting to buy certain foods, groceries or to take out the trash or waste garbage. Etc. There is a scientific explanation for this fact. In 2015, Liana Palermo offered 100 men and women different tasks to test their memory with the interval of lasting from 2 minutes to 1 day. As it turned out, women are better at remembering tasks for the future, whereas the completed tasks are forgotten, but men remembered them. Liana says, in addition to their basic work, Women have a lot of household chores and they have to keep a lot of information in their minds. That's how their memory gets trained. So if a task is finished, they forget. They are bad at remembering the completed tasks. Fact number two, women are able to smell men's pheromones in a crowd. Let's see a question. What is a pheromone? Pheromone is a secreted chemical factor that triggers a social response in the members of the same species. I would like to give you an example. If pheromone is on my body, outside my body, it can impact the person one who is capable of receiving it. There are a number of types in it. Okay, it can be triggered for alarm, trial, signal, releaser, sex, etc. American sexologists stated that the healthier a man is, the stronger his body odor is when attracting women. A woman can sense a man's presence even in a perfume store where a dozen other women have just sprayed perfume on their wrists. Besides, a female's sense of smell can even identify a man's immunity. She just needs three seconds to do it. The scientists from the University of British Columbia concluded that a partner's odor calms a woman down. It's no surprise that women being far from her partner will sometimes wear his t-shirt or shirt to feel closer to him. And I have heard people say this. Factor number three, women fall in love slower than men. I really do not know, regardless of what provokes love, the brain, the heart or the hormones I don't know. Men usually fall in love much faster than women. Some research showed that more than 25% of men fell in love between first and fourth dates, while only 15% of women reached the same result, means remaining 10% didn't feel it at all. In doing so, many women confessed that even after 20 dates, they could not quite feel butterflies in their stomach for men anymore. They needed a bit more time. After learning this, female insistence and selectiveness are quite understandable and they take a lot of time to select their guys. Fact number four, toxicosis during pregnancy is good for women. Those of you who do not know what is toxicosis, here is a small explanation. Toxicosis is nothing but 
the symptoms that occur during the first trimester of pregnancy like morning sickness, vomiting, giddiness, fatigue, headache, etc. Canadian researchers from Toronto found out that toxicosis during pregnancy contributes to a healthy development of a fetus. Morning sickness and headaches are both the result of defense mechanism that protects a fetus from harmful toxins. Thus, these unpleasant symptoms are actually good for women's health. Can you believe it? Women suffering from morning sickness often carry and give birth to healthy babies and are much less prone to miscarry. Besides, toxicosis can give a positive impact on baby's intelligence. However, symptoms like hyperemesis, nothing but excessive vomiting and severe stomach pains are not as healthy. In cases such as these, the pregnant women should immediately visit the doctor. Fact number 5. The higher a woman's IQ, the fewer children she has. British psychologist Satoshi Kanazawa has calculated that a woman's desire to have children decreases by 25% for every 15 extra IQ points she has. He concluded that humanity is generally becoming sillier because intelligent women don't want to have babies or just give birth to one. They prioritize self-education, self-development, career, and travel. He thinks that due to this reason, men often choose to marry women with more traditional values. I too cannot believe this, but researchers say, and I can say something about this. 20 or 30 years ago, when we heard somebody say that such a woman had 12 children, a dozen of children, we used to get surprised and it is still a surprise for us now. But in future, like 2040, when you hear somebody say a woman gave birth to a third child, you and me or that present generation will definitely be surprised. I hope it will definitely happen. Point number six. The more children a woman has, the faster she ages. Researchers from George Manson University in the US found out that women who gave birth to children have shorter telomeres than those who didn't. This means that the parts of chromosomes responsible for DNA protection get smaller with age. More than 2,000 women of different ages took part in this study. And it turned out that the more babies a woman has, the shorter her telomeres become. However, this can be caused due to different reasons like depression, stress, for example. And they also said that they are not persuading anybody not to have babies. It is likely that women with shorter telomeres can give birth to more children in the first place. The last and seventh interesting fact. Ladies in red make other women jealous. Ladies who wear red dress make other women jealous. Adam Pazda from Slovak Academy of Sciences conducted an unusual experiment. He asked men and women to look at photos of women and express their opinions about them. Some women in the photos were dressed in red while the rest wore other colors. The experiment showed that women actively respond to women wearing red cloths, seeing them as a threat to their relationship. Both men and women considered ladies in red dresses to be uninhibited and carefree. Women also mentioned that they wouldn't want their men to communicate with such ladies. I am saying this only to men. Women are jealous. I hear some people say they are always jealous. I'm not saying this, somewhere somebody is saying this. If you think this video is informative, funny, entertaining, give me a thumbs up. If you feel your friends also should know about this facts, seven interesting facts, please share the links with them. If you want me to talk about any topics that you are interested in or any messages or any suggestions for me, leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Love you all. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.